This is one of the articles that came out yesterday concerning Bone Token. Uh, as reported from you today, Shiba Inu's Bone Token renounced, and yes, what it means. So I'll be breaking down this article, then I'll be taking a look at the chart to see how it actually affected the chart. So let's just go straight into Shiba Inu's Bone Token that has undergone this uh, process or transformation that is known as renouncing. So um, I think it's been coming and it's really, really a, a seismic change, I'll say. So uh, let me break it down for you. You have first the big revelation where you no know, bone, which is this, the mighty, I'll not say this, is the mighty gas token in the Shibarium project has just uh, gone through a significant, I'll say metamorphosis, if you're good in biology. And uh, it's been called in the crypto world, uh, renouncing. And it is a term that is sending uh, really ripples right now. Everybody is probably, they've heard about it and uh, they're trying to get in. But if it's your first time, then kudos. So what does this really mean? And uh, why should you be excited? Well, you know, in the world of crypto, renouncing is like declaring independence, I'll say. And uh, it means the contract owner or the, I'll say the puppet master willingly relinquishes control. In the case of Bone, this move transforms it into a fully decentralized powerhouse, impervious to meddling or alterations. We have Carl, which is a, which, uh, is a developer in the Shiba Inu community, shouted it from I'll say the digital rooftops confirming this exciting uh, development on X or I'll say Twitter, whatever I want to call it. But uh, why is this such a big deal, you may ask? That's a very important question I'll be addressing. Um, because it is the epitome of decentralization, a core principle of the blockchain, I think. I'll say that the bone is no longer under the term of a single entity. And uh, it's a community driven force right now. So this move actually aligns with the Shiba Inu's commitment to, to building decentralized permissionless systems that empower and benefit the community at large. So let's talk a little bit about uh, the nitty gritty as usual. Um, renouncing isn't a flip flop of the switch affair. I mean, it's a, uh, I'll say it's a meticulous process involving a time lock contract and a decentralized uh, multi sig wallet. And every step is rigorously tested to eliminate errors and maintain the integrity of the system. So it's like it's like crafting a masterpiece, ensuring that every stroke adds to the, the beauty of the decentralization. So I'm just checking the distribution here. We see have a one wallet with 12.21%. Then you got a couple of exchanges holding a significant amount. So um so may ask that what happened after the grand renouncement well you can tell from the chat it was a couple of days ago well we had this little bump that was like on the 30th bone didn't just sit there i think it sold let's find out it sold about 11 uh, percent and according to latest data from uh, coin market cap the price of bones by uh, it reached actually we reached about yeah 90 cents right there it reached 90 cents with a market cap of around 220 uh, 6 million dollars so this this is not just a price move i think i think this is a validation of the community's trust and belief in the power of decentralization so i'll um just go through this article quick again to recap uh, what we've been talking about and answer some questions that you've been asking like uh, what does renouncing mean 
in the context of bone token, I'll just go through that again. You know, renouncing refers to the process of relinquishing control over the bone tokens contract, making it fully decentralized and immune to future changes and manipulation. Why is decentralization considered a significant development in the crypto space? Decentralization is a core principle of blockchain technology, ensuring that no single entity has control over it. It uh, promotes community-driven governance and resilience against unwanted interventions, fostering this trust and empowerment. So what's the significance of uh, Carl's announcement on the X social media platform? You know, it's a social media platform, right? So when Carl's announcement was actually confirmed, you know, the renouncement of Bone Token's ownership, well, this emphasizes the commitment of the Shiba Inu community to building decentralized and permissionless systems for the benefit of the wider community. So can you explain the intricate process involved in renouncement of the Bone Token? Like I said earlier, it's um, a, little, a little bit complicated, but this is a straightforward process which involves a time lock contract and a decentralized multi sig wallet. Each step is meticulously tested to eliminate errors, including setting allocation points to zero, generating a dummy token, updating reward structures, and the final renouncement of the bone contract. So what happened to the price of bone after the renouncement? We just checked on the chart. It spiked about 11%, but as usual, investors are taking profit. Possibly they know we might be uh, coming back down again, and it happened. And they're definitely buying again to make even more money. I mean, you must know how this market works in order to be uh, to take advantage of it. Normally, there's usually the hype, then there's usually... Uh, you know, the downturn, there's always a pullback. Right now, I'll say bone technically, yeah, we we'll found support right here. It's a solid support, but we'll keep on testing it at around 77 cent. But you don't want to keep poking that support. We might uh, eventually break through that. Especially now that we have, you see on the RSI, we were a little bit oversold, but uh, we are still way up there. We've left that area, but we are still way up there. We may have a reversal. This is the daily chart. And what we want to see right now is uh, for this to hold or we'll form a higher low year. Then we are, we are confident we'll be going back to test the $1 mark. That's what we want to see. So I do think that uh, there'll be, it's very, as it's proven now, there'll be a strong resistance at $1. So. As things develop, I'll be bringing you latest updates on the price predictions and the levels you must watch out for. Okay, thanks for watching, and that'll be it today. Cheers.